Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today's recipe is a very popular Caribbean drink at Christmas time, sorrel. In this bowl I have one pack of dried sorrel. I have placed this in water and I allow it to soak overnight along with some orange peel to do a little bit of infusion and from this I'm going to be making sorrel fruit cake and I'm also going to be making sorrel sponge cake sponge cake so if you have not yet subscribed to the channel please subscribe to the channel and check out all these sorrel videos I'm quickly gonna pound my ginger to get the best out of it here goes my ginger two cinnamon sticks some more of that orange peel and if you notice I have not put a lot of the rind on it I'm only using the skin and of course you cannot make sorrel without clove or you can also use allspice berries This has been boiling for about 25 minutes. I'm gonna allow it to go for five more minutes and then you'll see what I'll do next. Because sorrel is very, very acid and I want to make sorrel sponge cake and sorrel food cake, I'm gonna remove some of the pulp or most of it and I'm gonna allow it to keep boiling and I'm gonna start my sweetening process and I'm gonna leave this infuse overnight. I'm gonna leave the cinnamon sticks but I'm gonna take out the ginger and I'm gonna leave the orange peel for the sour make sure it's still hot I'm going in one cup of dark brown sugar allow it to dissolve I'm gonna cover this up and leave it overnight and allow the clove and the cinnamon sticks and stuff in there to draw and tomorrow I'm gonna continue sweetening this this is the final product it has since been three days that I have had this sorrel in my refrigerator I am adding three cups of granulated sugar because sorrel is very very acid but this is not as acid as it would be as if I have had left the pulp in it because I have removed the pulp. It is very strong because I soaked it, but it's not as acid. So I'm going to put about four cups instead. 